I'd be willing to eat pre-chewed. I'd lick my shoe. Yeah, you would definitely sing in the middle of the street, dressed up. We're on the corner of Wellington and King right now, and what was your name? Rachel. Rachel. Basically what Joan and I are doing this afternoon, going around, seeing how far people are willing to go for a fist full of cash. This is with the FM96 Poke Jewelers Threesome. And what is it you said that you would do just a moment ago? I'd be willing to eat pre-chewed gum off the ground for wow. a fist full of cash. Joan, how much do you think that's worth, man? I would say like maybe like 50 to 100 bucks. I don't know, like if you look down on the ground, like this is gum. That black crap right there? Yeah, that's... So like, would you take it that far to peel all that off and then eat it? Uh, if somebody did all the hard work and peeled it off for me, then yeah, I'd eat it. Do you think any flavor would be left in that? Um, apart from a bit of grit, probably not, no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I think that she should get 250 bucks for that, probably Hello? the bowl of that. Yeah, okay, I can see that happening. Okay. We'll pass the message on to Tucker and Tess. Okay, all right. <laughs> all right, we're on the corner of uh, Dundas and Wellington right now, Danielle and JP. Jonah's here too. We're trying to figure out what it is people will do for a fist full of cash. And uh, just a second ago, Jonah asked what? What did you ask well, JP? I was wondering if JP would lick the bottom of Danielle's shoe for a fist full of cash. Now, is that reasonable to get a fist full of cash? Yeah, yeah. Even though that you don't know where that shoe has been, the trend in poop, spit, it's probably <laughs> gone. It's better I don't know. Well, I guess that's right. <laughs> so what amount of cash would you be talking? Like, would 50 bucks do it? Seventy-five. Oh no! Now back to the shoe. Yeah. I'd lick my shoe. For yeah. 75. You'd lick yeah. your own shoe for seventy-five. <laughs> I, I, I do too. Yeah. yeah. Seventy-five bucks. That's it. Yeah. That's all. Two hundred fifty would be better. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Here on the corner, Dundas and Wellington, with Sean, Jonah once again. Yep. Trying to figure out ways of how to give away uh, fistfuls of cash. Yeah. And uh, what do we come up with for Sean? Here? What's or, Sean willing we, to do? For seventy dollars, seventy-five dollars. What would Sean do? Would he sing in the middle of the street? Sean, yeah, would I would you? definitely sing in the middle of the street, dressed up as Angus Young, singing Shook Me All Night Long for 75 bucks. This seems pretty reasonable. Yeah. That seems huge. So you'd be willing to get in the kilt and everything. Oh yeah. Whatever. For 75 bucks. Oh yeah. You're a cheap date. Yeah. Well, whatever. <laughs> what, what if we asked you to uh, dress up like that cowboy guy they got in New York and sing songs like he does? You might have to check, put in an extra 25 bucks, Ooh. but pushing it up to a <laughs> yeah.